you played England in your life? Well, Dick, I've, I've worked in England for the last 20 years, really. All right, now, go back a little ways, not to the very beginning, but do you remember a tour when there was a, an opening act uh, who became really, very famous? Really, really, the Rolling Stones. That was yeah. about 1963. What was your impression of that group? A well, hit. I knew they were. Yeah? Fantastic. All right. Half a second, let me reveal the other guest here standing at the piano, ladies and gentlemen, from the Rolling Stones, Mr. Keith Richards. <laughs> Same question. Yes, How old were you when you were on that tour? Uh, 19. What did you think of him? Same thing I thought when I first heard his first record, and chills and fever down the left side. Yes. Chills and fever? <laughs> now, why would a man who has all the money in the world, the fame and the popularity, fly here on a quick call, you're in Jamaica, and say, we're doing a television show for Jerry Lee Lewis. What's the inspiration for that? Same reason I'm wearing a tux for the first time in my life. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, for this gentleman. Why do, why do you think people of several generations have been inspired by him? Because he's so good. Uh, if we could put all three of you gentlemen together, uh, I know you don't do these things ad lib. Do you, you like Hank Williams' music? I can get behind it. Uh, Mick, is Hank, uh, Hank Williams all right with you? Fine with me. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a first. You need something to play, though. How do I do I do this in alphabetical order? Let's see. Uh, Fleetwood, Richards, uh, anyway, the guy. <laughs> Yeah. 